Hello and welcome to Walker Analytics. My name is Wesley Walker. I'm the founder and director of Walker Analytics. And in today's video, I'm going to take you through the brand new Google Analytics 4 certification. Now this certification came out in August and it's been a long awaited certification because we've already had the Google Analytics certification for beginners and advanced and power users. But now we have one specifically for Google Analytics 4, which was well needed because Universal Analytics and GA4 are built very differently. Um, so I think certification was well needed um, for the new version of Google Analytics. So, but before we begin, if any of you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more Google Analytics videos and drop a like down below if you enjoyed this. So on Skillshop, you can see that there is now Google Analytics certification and this you'll easily be able to find if you Google Google Analytics 4 certification. The first page you'll see is the Google Analytics 4 resources within Skillshop. And then at the bottom here, we have Google Analytics certification, which is the new um, exam that was enabled in August. So when we click into it, we can see there's a bit of information about what to expect and what this certification will give you. And Google says that you showcase your ability to use Google Analytics 4 to gain valuable insights and make marketing decisions. Certified users will demonstrate an understanding of Google Analytics, including how to set up and structure a property and use various supporting tools and features. By earning the Google Analytics certification, Google recognizes your ability to set up a Google Analytics 4 property for a website or an app, collect the data you need for your business and use the various supporting tools and features, recognize key measurement features that can show the effectiveness of your online marketing efforts, and just know that some courses may contain links to sites that may not be available in your preferred language or requiring to select your language. With this specific exam, that was not an issue for me when, when I did it. So then you have the link to the exam and there's also some resources that you can use to study um, in preparation for the exam. Um, my take on this is that if you've done some Google Analytics for implementations already um, and you think you have a good grasp of it, then you don't really need to do go through the study resources. I just went straight in and did the certification because I've already done quite a few GA4 implementations and consultations and reporting. Um, but if you feel like you're still very much a beginner when it comes to Google Analytics 4, then you'll probably want to go through the study resources first and before you do the certification. So with the certification, it's a 75 minute time limit to do the entire assessment which is quite typical um, that you will tend to see with previous Google Analytics certifications and it consists of 50 questions with 75 minutes to complete it. Um, you need a score of 80% or higher to pass. If you end the assessment early or the time runs out before you have answered enough questions correctly, you will not pass and will not be able to resume from where you left off, so you need to start all over again. And you must wait one day before retaking this assessment if you failed your last attempt. So as previously mentioned, I myself recently did the Google Analytics 4 certification and I passed. And I feel like the 75 minute timing that you do get is more than enough for 50 questions. They are very simple questions that you are asked of Google Analytics 4. And the structure is pretty much the same as all the previous Google Analytics certifications of recent years. So if you've done the beginner of Google Analytics certification and the advanced, then you'll be very well prepared to take on the Google Analytics 4 certification. Some of you might be thinking, is it actually worth it? Should you actually go ahead and do this certification? And I think it can probably vary somewhat on your profession. So if you're an analytics consultant like myself, and you're doing quite a lot of, or you're taking on quite a bit of work around Google Analytics 4 and implementations and consultancy, then I think it is worthwhile to have a certification because then it just gives your clients and your future clients peace of mind that you are more than capable of providing an consultancy for GA4 and you know it, it helps your clients to know that you you know what you're doing and of course um, having a certification doesn't mean that you're a, a complete expert in GA4 but it does it does show that you have some grounding of, of how the platform works and I think it's worthwhile if you're a consultant if you're an analytics professional so say you're a full-time or a permanent employee and um, it still can be worthwhile you completing the Google Analytics 4 certification, as you can show your managers and your stakeholders in the, in the company that you work for that you're competent in this new 
uh, version of Google Analytics. I don't think it's as viable as a consultant or a freelancer because you get the benefit as a consultant freelancer that you can showcase the clients, potential clients that you you know, know know what you're doing with regards to Google Analytics 4 and because of the deadline next year um, with the with the shutdown universe analytics, there's been a spike in demand for Google Analytics 4 professionals. So it's a good time to be a digital analytics consultant because of the the demand that's that's needed for you know new year for implementation of consultancy. Um, as a permanent employee, there's there's still there are benefits there, and I would recommend still taking it if you are in the digital analytics space or you just want to know and understand Google Analytics 4 a bit better. Um, then go through the study material and then do certification to prove that you you know that you have a, a decent foundations of how the platform works. Um, but the benefit, I think, for this certification is definitely more leaning towards the consultants than it is for the full-time employees. So that's my review of uh, the Google Analytics 4 certification. Have you taken it or are you planning on taking it or do you, will you not be taking it? Let me know in the comment section down below and I'll see you on my next video.